In this video, we're going to talk about the archive page query type, which is available in the Divi Filter Grid plugin available at DiviPlugins.com. In order to add the archive page query type, we need to be in the theme builder since it'll be used for the archive page templates. So we go to Divi, theme builder, and then add new template. And we're going to select the archive pages, all category pages, create template, and then we're going to customize the body. Once this loads, we're going to add the Divi filter grid module to the page. And then we're going to select the archive page query type. I'm also going to scroll down to the filters options section and we're going to turn off the filters. So let's go ahead and save that. And actually I'm going to add, uh, let's see, go to the post elements and we're going to go to the, um, show post meta we're going to turn on terms and we're going to leave it at, at the uh, default category so that we can see the categories uh, on our category pages to make sure that we have the right ones all right so we save this and then exit out of it so that we can save the changes and now if we go to our animals uh, category page which is our default layout here and refresh now it should be in a grid format there it is we've removed our filters and we have a nice grid of animal categories uh, if I click on nature then it should change to just the uh, nature categories and it looks like it's working right so <clears throat> again this is uh, this query type is available for any archive page, categories, authors, uh, search results, those types of pages, it'll automatically detect what uh, results should be displayed and will display them.